This week, we're rounding up the best Ultrabook tablet convertibles. Whether you're looking to upgrade your notebook, make the most out of Windows 8 touch capabilities, or just want a device with other possibilities for work and play, well, these are our top choices just for you. First up, we have the Lenovo IdeaPad Yoga 13. It's available in a cheaper 11-inch Windows 8 RT model and a higher price 13-inch Windows 8 64 model. The one we have here is the 13-inch model with the IPS display. The premium design features with the tack matte feel to the cover and the leather touch palm rest were small touches we liked. With a third gen Intel Core i7 processor, Windows 8 64, 4GB of RAM and 128GB hard drive, the Lenovo will definitely be reliable for your day-to-day -day workload and entertainment uses, especially with its 8-hour battery life. But it really comes into its own when we discovered its convertible ability, since its hinges have been updated so the screen can rotate 360 degrees. With the ability to flip the Lenovo into four different modes, such as laptop mode for business or productive work, tablet mode for gaming or touch browsing, stand mode for when watching movies, and finally tent mode so you can view it easily when in the kitchen cooking up a storm. We also warm to the idea of using the yoga in portrait mode whilst browsing sites or for viewing recipes. All in all, the Lenovo is everything and more you may want for your day-to-day -day tasks. With its thin and lightweight feel, as well as the ability to easily manoeuvre and suit your needs, and its long battery life, you shouldn't be complaining. Next up, we have the Dell XPS 12. It's a handily sized 12-inch Ultrabook with the ability to purchase it in Intel Core i5 or i7 with 4 or 8GB of RAM, and either 128 or 256GB hard drives. The XPS 12 has a curve-like design with Kefla fibre finish to the screen lid and an aluminium casing around the edges, making the Ultrabook feel and look durable. The transformation is simple, as when you want to work in tablet mode, the screen is able to move in a flip and fold motion, allowing you to work in two different modes. The only slight problem we had with the Dell was that although it's a 12-inch model, when in tablet mode it's quite heavy to hold and work with. The Dell is an easy convertible with a simple switch to flip between tablet and Ultrabook. It has a design that will attract the younger audience and those who want something that they can use in day-to-day -day activities and be able to fit it in their bag easily. Next up, we have the Tai Chi by Asus. With Windows 8 or Windows 8 Pro installed, the user journey will always be fluid and efficient with the Intel Core i5 or i7 processor on board and 4GB of RAM. The design is slick and it seems perfect for city workers and professionals who would want to use the Tai Chi for work. What's different to this compared to the Lenovo and the Dell is that it has two screens, something we haven't seen before in an Ultrabook. One of the screens is used in the same way as a standard laptop and another on the back of the laptop acting as a tablet-like screen. The mirror mode makes it easy to share your media to another person sitting in front of you, making it perfect for playing a movie on long train journeys. And finally, the dual screen mode lets your audience view your presentations on one screen while you read the notes from the other. The Tai Chi is something that screams of innovation and definitely a device which will do well with its slim and sleek design and astonishing Sonic Master Audio co-developed with Bang & Olsen. Hopefully these tablet ultrabook hybrids have given you the insight of what's out there. With convertibility, efficiency and productivity in mind, one device could offer an array of possibilities.